Glacier, to me, is many things. Groundbreaking, I think unique, but in some ways probably uh, didn't go as intended. Glacier was a uh, short-lived WCW superstar. He's using his kicks in combination. Who is Glacier? Oh, yeah. D did he pass away? Got him up! Jackhammer time! Look, what? I remember sitting on the edge of the ring saying, I don't know if I'm ever going to be good at this, but I've just found what makes me freaking come alive, you know, and I got to pursue this with everything I got. What made Glacier this athlete who too many people regard as a joke or bad, like what made it not work? Glacier was a Mortal Kombat character brought to life. WCW was looking for a more diverse palette of characters. So there had to be someone who was willing to take the risk and say, let's see if this works. We'll dive all in. And when the president of the company says, we're going to throw all this money into it, I mean, who wouldn't say yes to that? Bischoff was a bit of a visionary there. He was just about 20 years too early. It didn't matter who was in that Glacier gimmick, the fans wouldn't have liked it because of the buildup that we had. He also may have been the first victim of receiving a really huge hype where maybe creative and other things wasn't uh, fully teed up for him. We put so much time and money into trying to make that ca that character work, you know, and you have to do that if you really want to get a character over. But the bad news is, is that when it when it slips and falls, it hits with a really big thud, and sometimes that thud resonates for a long, long time. I came back for one of my college football games and uh, ran into one of my former coaches. He said, what are you doing these days? And I, and I told him I was teaching school and I was still, and, and I know what I was excited to say, I'm still pursuing the professional wrestling, it's going pretty good right now. And just this look on his face was a look of like, like kind of shock. And he said, you know, are you really still pursuing that crap? And I remember it, it was like someone had punched me in the stomach. To me it was like, he didn't believe that that was something I could be doing or should be doing. There's not one person in there expected Glacier to come in, and then the music hit and everybody lost their mind. I didn't know what kind of crowd would be there. I didn't know if they would, if I'd be received well. I didn't know if I'd get laughed out of the place. Over the 21 years I've been able to proudly do the gimmick and still B Glacier, the thousands upon thousands of people who have told me how much they enjoyed it, that's what I kind of hang my hat on. I can't believe he's still taking bumps. That blows me away. A lot of the guys around here can't even walk around or sit down, and he's still taking bumps after all these years. I've been training a lot because I had hip replacement uh, two years ago, uh, and now I'm back to the point where I feel like I can, I can do, with limitations, I can do a lot in the ring now. He's still Glacier. He's still amazing. Most respectful and caring cats I ever met. He doesn't forget the people who helped him to get to the spot. It's the man and the character that means something to me. The critics of, of, of the Glacier gimmick, I, I get it to a certain degree, but the world is going to be full of people that tell you what you can't do. You just got to let those people not rent space in your head, because they will if you let them. Glacier uh, is an outstanding human being, one of my dearest friends. It's not about the paycheck, you know? I mean, I don't do it today for the money anyway. I mean, I never did, but it's more about getting out there giving back to the fans. You know, like at 53 years old, I don't have to be doing yeah, this, you know? But, uh, but I love it, you know, it's, it's, it's where my heart is. You know, if you want to see what I can do, tell me what I can't do. Because life's 10% of what happens to you and 90% how you react to it. You can always, always, always control how you react to it. There was not one single time that I ever remember putting my feet on the floor and saying, oh God, I got to go do this, do this again today. And I wish every person could experience what that feels like. Just let them know, you know what, I'm doing this because I love it. It is something that I will never, ever forget. To ever. That is Thank you so much for sharing that. Yeah, I'm sorry, it's, it's just, no, dude, I never, that's, I never can tell it without, without tearing up because, you know, it, it was just, man, just, it was an awesome experience, you know, so.